well, we need to then come up with an approach, a culture, a way of bringing that promise to the market, and that's what the leadership behaviors are about. Hartford Healthcare Provider Leadership Development Institute, known as PLDI, is committed to taking traditional medical education to the next level. This really took it up a notch and got me to the next level to play around and, and gives me a springboard to, to go forward with. I have a background in both healthcare and uh, MBA in healthcare. Uh, management and I found this went beyond that. Our program's focus is on leadership competencies that address both technical and emotional components. This underscores the need to develop skills that are often overlooked in the provider world. Leadership is not about a title, it's about a behavior. What got you here isn't going to get you there um, is kind of the underscore of, of kind of the class. Providers are often positioned in organizations as leaders based on their technical abilities, but lack the leadership skills to motivate their colleagues and teams to work as an effective unit. Training as a group of interprofessional colleagues is extremely important because that is the real world aspect of healthcare. This program provided us the opportunity to have a common language, look at common goals, and work well together despite coming from different backgrounds and different training levels. The course really does emphasize teamwork, collaboration, and those really contrast to medical education. Teamwork and collaboration can help us raise the bar of excellence. Two of the most critical elements providers learn are the concepts of self-awareness and emotional intelligence. It has increased my emotional intelligence dramatically. When you're a happier provider and you have a happier work environment, it just rolls forward into your patients and they have a better patient experience. The curriculum focuses on evidence-based leadership competencies that improve interpersonal relationships, teamwork, collaboration, quality and safety, and ultimately, the patient experience. If you're going to turn it on for the workday, you haven't figured it out. But if you live it, it's a lot easier. Leadership skills are not executed in a vacuum. We all work within a team, and this opportunity provided that for us, which was extremely unique and something that I'm very grateful to have had the opportunity for.